Ladies and gentlemen, Red Lighter in the building! Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> what's up, what's up? How we doing? What's going on? Man? Good, man. How you doing? I'm doing excellent. I believe you guys already know Michaela, uh, out of, also out of Buffalo. What's going on? Man? What's going on? Hell yeah. Uh, for, the, for those of the, that may not know you guys, could you please properly introduce yourself? Let us know. I know you're in Buffalo, but plug or promote anything you'd like. How about that? There you go. Go ahead and plug and promote there, Nick. We are Red Letter. We're a Speak bunch up. Of, we're Red Letter. We're a bunch of fucking degenerates from Buffalo, New York. We play shows and stuff, and we make noise, and I yell at people. Yeah. So he's the singer. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, we, uh, yeah, obviously from Buffalo, New York, um, metalcore band. All of the songs basically are uh, positive messaging. That's basically what we're about. So, and I'm sure you're going to hear some songs so you can see what we're saying, you know? What do you think we should start with? We play we play all of them pretty much on a regular basis, but what do you think we should start with? Should we go to the oldest <laughs> and kind of get to the new stuff? Play your favorite first. He's going he's not going to play any then. Yeah. Yes. It's <laughs> over. They, they, that's the end of the interview. No, okay. Let's let's start with Daggers. The hardest smoking a blunt. There you go. Let's start with Daggers. We'll also take a couple of rips. And uh, then we'll chit chat, just so everybody can hear what you guys sound like if, if they're unfamiliar. Yo, who do you guys who do you guys go to for all your recordings? <laughs> well, this one was done by uh, Mike Hadalak from uh, It Dies Today. Um, <clears throat> our most recent track, uh, most recent couple uh, are going through Anthony Potenza from here in uh, Buffalo. Okay. How did how did how do you initially link up with somebody from It Dies Today? Is that just messaging them like, uh, "Hey, we want to work with uh, you," or did you happen to you? Well, well, <laughs> well, It Dies Today is uh, they're from basically Niagara Falls, this area, and I've been I personally been friends with Mike for a good twenty years, so he's always been like he's recorded uh, other various artists like Barrier Dead and stuff like that. So he's been doing it for a long time, but not too much anymore. He kind of like took a step back on recording but Bummer. but it's it happens uh oh, fellas yeah. let's say hypothetically you just played for twenty thousand people for some reason and everyone was just like this is the best band i ever heard they're chanting your name blah 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 so now it's time to party we're backstage we're celebrating who's the last man standing after all the shots and, and beer chugs are taken oh Pro yeah probably hello. tony hello <laughs> let's let's chug some beer right now tony God bless you. That's right. Hell yeah. Uh, Michaela, do you have any questions for the fellas? I know you're pretty familiar with them. Is, is the best wing spot bar bill? Is, that, is it true? Is no. that the general consensus? I, I don't like chicken wings. Nope. Nine, <laughs> I can't answer this question. 911 Tabard. Yep. Okay. Yeah, 911 is good. I, I don't That's mind good. bar bill, but I think there's definitely better than that. Route 78. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> I mean, they ain't bad though. They're the Bradford the wings there, yeah. Best in my opinion, dude. What's wait? What's I what's that? Point is any local? What, wait, wait, wait. What's that place? I, what's that place? I have to try the Bradford wings. Oh, oh so. Gabriel's, Gabriel's, Gabriel's Gate. Gabriel's Gate. Gabriel's yeah. Gabriel's 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 I need to come to Buffalo for just for two yeah. reasons: just catch a bunch of bands, like performances, like like a like a Friday Saturday trip, and then come back Sunday and like hit up like six Buffalo wing spots, like lunch, dinner, lunch. All right, so if anybody tells you to go to Anchor Bar or Duff's, don't fucking don't do it. Don't, don't do it. Do okay. not do it. No, no. Heard. No, no, no. See, <laughs> yeah. Taurus trap. Yeah. Mica Michaela knows it's a no bueno. Just, you don't yeah. do that. No, just, no, no, just, no, just no, no, no. bueno. Under, under our ever wings. We'll take it's care. exactly what it is, is the Taurus trap. For sure, oh, especially Anchor Bar. Dude, Anchor Bar looks like a tourist. Well, they, they, it's all like glitzy and stuff. Yeah. Well, they throw one. They threw one in the airport. Too. Yeah, they're they're everywhere. Dang. Dude, you really did. Sellouts. Yeah. It is fucking. Ten wings, fifty nine ninety nine. Yeah. Oh god. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You know, what, you is, know, what is what is uh what is the crowdless what is the crowdless about like from a lyrical perspective? There you go, there you go Nick. Go ahead, um, buddy. Well. 
from a band perspective, that one was just all of us trying to deal with the ebbs and flows of everything that was happening with the fucking pandemic, dude. Like, finding ourselves trapped in these fucking houses, nothing to do, no one outside, listening to the news changing up and down, trying to think, like, how the fuck we're going to exist in a world like that, and then just kind of slapping it on paper and taking the initiative to kind of, like, throw some of that emotion into a good song for people to vibe with. Hell yeah, real talk. I can dig it. Pandemic's been... I mean, the worst. Hell yeah, fire. Um, I know you guys have a surprise for us a little bit later uh, regarding like a feature that you just worked on or something like that. But before we get to that, before we get to that, yeah. I, I do want to do some trivia with you. and Maybe we can review a band or two together. Uh, regarding the trivia, if there's some way you guys could unanimously decide on one th question or topic I'll ask you about, anything in the film or TV industry, Dexter, South Park, Harry Potter, literally anything on Netflix... <laughs> Uh, what what do you say you know the most about? And you can all guess. I'm gonna ask you a really hard question because it's, it's a couple people in the room here. So, South Park, maybe yeah, maybe Stranger Things. Stranger I, Things. I, 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 don't know. I, I I'm I'm out on Stranger Things. Of course, uh, The Office. Oh shit. <laughs> yeah, any of those will work. Any of those will work. Yeah, maybe The Office a little bit. The office, maybe. Office sounds know. good. South Park. I'll I'll go I'll go office while we jam really quick. We'll we'll jam uh, ghost chant and give me a second to look it up. All right, fellas, I think I'm gonna stump you on this. Here we go. What award does Phyllis win at the Dundies? What is the name of the award that Phyllis wins at the Dundies? Can I answer it? It's the bushiest beaver award. <laughs> that is correct. It says also it would have been accepted as the busiest beaver, but oftenly mistaken, they engraved it as the bushiest beaver. Oh my God. We'll, <laughs> we'll spin the wheel and see what it lands on. Um, and then let's jam a random band and see what we got. Yeah. Did we play this one? I don't think we played that one. No, we've not heard this. Bloodletting Prince. I kind of dig it. What do you guys think? Yeah, it's fire, dude. Oh, yeah. Not bad. I like it. Yay. Not bad. That's it's very uh, girthy. Oh, that's a yay, by the way. That hits me in all the anger yeah. feels in the right way. Mm-hmm. Where do we go to obtain the brand new awesomeness that features Sean of I the Breather? I can uh, send you... Where can I send you the link to it? Can you Facebook message me real quick? Would that work? Yeah, sure. Perfect, because then I can yeah, just I can pull it up on this screen and then just like slide it over. So, yeah, go on our um, you can go on our line app, copy the link. Oh yeah, I got, got it. it. Oh, got wait, it? you gonna do it? Yeah, Nick's gonna Nick's gonna send it over to you. Cool. While he does that, real quick, we'll check out one more. Crosstown Rivals. This one's called Everything. <laughs> Fellas, tell me tell me the worst gig story ever. What is the show that you guys played where like everything went wrong? During that particular show. Oh, well, we can, uh, I would say, uh, I would say, uh, this place called Stamps. Okay, so basically, we're a five piece, right? And it's like, we're all try, try to imagine having like a drummer and then three other dudes that are six foot plus with rigs and all this stuff all crammed in a, a half bath. Dude. Okay. Dude. So that's and, how that's how and, small the stage is. And then the, and then the speakers the fucking... sound like you're farting on cardboard. It's true. It's so true. Foot, they're like six foot. Yeah. It's, it's weird up there. It's real bad. Kyle, oh, legit. I, I hit my head on a fucking pole like seven times. Yeah, it's literally so, a beam right in the middle of the stage. I was going to say, the beam. I was, I, our show a, was right. There's a huge support beam for the building in the f fucking middle of the stage. Yeah. <laughs> like, you know, like, it's I, so I, stupid. I hit my head on this thing literally seven times during the show. So I just said, okay, I just accepted defeat and just leaned against it for the rest of it. I'm like, just I'm like, just gonna I'm just gonna spoon with it. 
and it was a Sunday after a Bills game, so oh, I was yeah. highly hungover at that point. So, yes. so the, uh, most, the most yeah. important takeaway from this is Kyle is our official resident stripper. Yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. yeah. There's a point. <laughs> Kyle's there. <laughs> so you guys are diehard Bill fans. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, so so yeah. every no, year no, every year in no football I root for the Bills to play the Vikings because we're He's both zero and four in the Super Bowl. And someone we gotta break the curse. And if we play each other, then someone's gonna break it. So every year you're, that's who I root to play in the yeah. Super Bowl. Your Vikings need a little help there. Hey, hey, you be nice. <laughs> you be nice about my Vikings. I think, now. I think Mikhail is being a, a little nice there. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> this could be our year. Now. This I could mean, be our you year. You do have Justin Jefferson, this, though, man. This could be our year, you mean? This could be the Vikings year. Yeah. Okay, Vikings. okay, cool. I don't like all the Bills hype, though. I hate when they hype us up. Like, every time you turn on, like, NFL Network, you're just talking about the Bills. Yes. And it's like, just let no, us just, be, like, kind of, like, lay in the for, background. And just, yeah, just I forget know. forget we exist. We're the underdogs. Yeah, we Let don't us, exist. Uh, yeah, we always thrive as underdogs. So. We like yeah. the underdogs. All I'm, I'm going to say is, who's Josh? Like that? <laughs> you like that? Yes. I, I hear you. I hear you. I hear you. No, speak, I hear you. I'm you queuing speak, up the song. I hear you with the Kirk Cousins things. Yeah, BG, it's... check it out. So, speaking of Josh Allen, here you go. I don't know if you oh. can see this. Yes. Let's go. That's one of like this, 20 here. This is uh, it's worth about, I don't know if you can see it really well. It's worth about two, three bucks, right? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you, got the, you got a one of one? You have a one of one? <laughs> We're 30K, man. You gotta, that's, you dang, it is a one of one. That's the that's the bazooka bubble come one. Yeah, don't sell it. 30, 30, don't sell it. Cart, man. That's amazing. <laughs> I have a couple of cool horror autographs, but nothing nothing half half as cool as that, I would say. Yo, so how did how did this feature come about with Sean? Uh well playing a show with him. Yeah. Well what happened was um well we ended up playing a show with him, but prior to um I I don't know how how did it come. I I was. I had, him as, for a while. Well, I was I was. Ta- oh yeah yeah. So originally I was talking to him for my old band, uh, Mackay back in the day, um, about doing a feature, and then I was like, you know what? Oh, I think I'm gonna reach out to him again. So I talked to him several times before, and I've been a, a fan of his band for a long time since like 2010 with songs like Common Good and stuff like that, All Spark. Um, and, um, and Nick's talked to him a bunch of times. And then anyways, long story short is he was down with it. Um, I sent him over the, you know, the song, some ideas, and he just flowed with it and made it super dope. He killed it on his feature. So, and he, and they, they had a newer song out too. So what they did was they ended up doing a, a, a tour. Uh, I forget how long it was. I'm sure Sean, if he pops on, he'll tell you. But um, uh, we played with them here at Mohawk Place here in Buffalo, which is a, a pretty cool venue, uh, nostalgic venue that's been around forever. But yeah, I mean, it was it was sick, man. It was it's our first feature ever, um, and I, I don't regret a thing about it. He he knocked it out of the park, and I mean, I do it a hundred times over. Where uh, when when is it officially like releasing and all the the Spotify's and all that. So, so the song is releasing releasing uh, July thirteenth. Um, we have a pre save and everything like that, ready to rock and roll for it. Um, and the video, if not on the thirteenth, will be relatively uh, soon after. We're just deciding. We're talking with PR and everything to see when the the best time to release it is. But the song itself on all platforms, you know. Spotify, Apple Music, etc. It's gonna be uh, July thirteenth. So there it is. Are we, so how, are we allowed to play like 30, 40 seconds of it? Is that you is can play the whole play? thing, man? We're allowed to jam it. All right, hell yeah. I'd say that's Rock an exclusive, run, ladies and gentlemen. Here yes. we go. I didn't know it was like that. Hold on. I'm already like, wow. <laughs> it, like the video looks amazing already. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> I think we should start this over one more time. Coming in hot. hot. Uh, oh, yo, this, this, was, this, was, uh, this was shot in the church downtown Buffalo. Yeah, we almost lit on fire. Really? We did, actually. Yes. Dude, were they aware that all the pyrotechnics and stuff were going down? Were they like, oh, we, didn't were, sign, the, we, didn't, the people, we didn't sign up for this? The people that owned it, were they were super cool. Yeah. yeah. 
Awesome. That's cool. Pow, we're getting all the drum shots too. Like all the drum shots are perfect for all the quick fills and stuff. And there's a lot of quick camera changes. There's a lot of oh, yeah. fire going on. The wide, the wide shots show like how big that church actually is. It looks like it's really, really massive inside. Oh yeah. From old school like Catholic churches, it's like probably 60, 70 feet tall. Yeah. It was yeah. Very, very. Uh, yeah, when we had the pyro stuff set up, I'm like, oh, I don't know about this. Bro. The drum sounds fantastic in that. Place. Yeah. <laughs> Props to Tyler White on uh, you shooting this video. Yeah. By the way, yeah, he did yeah. a fantastic job. And Tyler did a great job. Red All Media. Yep. Hell yeah! Shout out to Tyler. Well done. Okay, 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 okay. Hold on, hold on. Hold up. <laughs> let me catch my breath. Let me go. Let me go change my underwear real quick. Is this okay? It's okay. already that damn good. Whew. Okay, here we go. This is Sean's part. It's got so many individual little cool things happening. Like right after, right after the feature part, like there was a little quick, did not see it coming vocal part, and then right back into the hook, and then every single like intense one hit is like crazy fire going on in the background and exactly on those hits so it just makes you just want to go like ah! guys it's so good so far i can't wait to hear the rest like it really really is everything is superb about it for real michaela what do you think before we before we even continue what do you think no you're taking the words right out of my mouth dude guys this is this is fucking this is awesome. a game changer we're gonna hit the button Thanks for hanging out with us before you're rich and famous. We appreciate it. This is it. It's just like it's like the giving tree, dude. It just keeps giving. <laughs> it just keeps giving. <laughs> hell yeah. Shout out to Red Out Media. They crushed it. Well done. I mean for Give real. Me a hell yeah. Yeah. Woo. Thanks, gentlemen. It's, it's superb. Dude. Like, obviously, like we've we've played shows together before, and I've I've heard you guys perform that live. But like, the production value and like the recording and the video, dude, everything is fucking excellent, dude. I'm I'm really stoked for you guys. This shit is awesome. Thank you, <laughs> thank you. I appreciate Hell it. Thanks. I 100 percent agree. Thank y'all. Cheers. Hell yeah. Thank you. Yeah, that song was done with Anthony Potenza. Just remember, you saw it first on local band Smoke Out. Yeah, you Go did. Out. That's right. You're damn right. You did. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Hell yeah. Uh, so what do you guys have planned for the rest of 2022 that you're allowed to to talk about? Like uh, maybe some yeah, stuff, um, fall time, winter time, anything you can you can let us know. We got <laughs> July 31st. Uh, we're playing uh, one of the bigger venues here in Buffalo called Ironworks with Attack Attack and Red Jumpsuit Apparatus. <laughs> it's kind That's of awesome. interesting. Hell yeah. But, Excellent. Yeah, I mean, that'd be cool. We, uh, we also have another song that's um, done being recorded that'll be dropping um, probably in August. Okay, and so we're going to... Another song gonna... right after this one comes out. Another right one right away. Yeah. Feeding the People. It's awesome. We yeah, got yeah this one's probably... Them. I think heavier than burn it down. We got lots of goodies for you guys coming up. So the the, the idea is the idea is is which you know a lot of the you know the the local musicians and the not so mainstream musicians are doing, which is the way to go. I think is uh, you know you, you, nowadays you don't drop a full album, right? Like you want to drop a single, you you know, otherwise you know you drop an album. It goes like this and falls, right? So you want to drop a single for a month, a single. You know, want to keep that. You know, you, you want to keep the dopamine going. You want pe people's interest. To, you know, keep at a at a decent level, um, and keep things fresh. So that's what we're trying to do. We want we, to keep them hard. Yeah, keep them hard. Keep them bricked up. <laughs> keep them bricked up. Yeah, like when you throw, <laughs> throw that friggin' sausage ring right on there. We're better than Viagra. People <laughs> gotta understand this. You said sausage <laughs> ring. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man. Hell yeah. You gotta keep you gotta you gotta keep the bratwurst at full mass. Sell the shit. Sell the shit in a bottle. I love it. You can't. It's too volatile. <laughs> oh shit. It's crazy. Uh, Michaela, let me let me do you, ask him one more question. I, I'm gonna search for one more trivia, uh, if I can find it. If you have another question, Michaela, my bad. On the spot. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> so. 
So what's what's the next show after um, the red jumpsuit? That's the only one we got booked right now because we're trying to um, be, be a little selective with our uh, show playing. Um, yeah, so it's, we're that's not to- like totally you know, understandable. You know, show, it's, big it's, shows it's, it's 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 yeah. I mean, it's it's not even that. It's we're just trying to like you know. I mean, preferably if we could, uh, but you, it as you know, you can't be possible. you can't be too picky yeah. when you're in our position. Like we're we're I, I still consider us a brand new band because we we were born at the beginning of you know, COVID. So like we've only played a a handful of shows to a handful of people. We really don't have a huge following yet, so that's why we're trying to do things the right way with this track, and then uh, you know, following suit with the other songs coming forward. You know. Yeah, I think you guys are doing the right thing by by doing it that way. Um, Thanks, man. Uh, I'm pretty. You're probably gonna do like a, a like. Is there gonna be like a big YouTube channel exclusive drop like for the actual video that'll be posted on like a a space on travel or a something along the lines of that for the video? For the video, I mean, we we haven't decided exactly how we're gonna do it, but this was like you know, like we said, this was the first time anyone's actually seen the video besides us and the band um wow so, appreciate it yeah so that's why we were super stoked and you know we've always been a big fan of your guys you know show it's always been hilarious and such a damn good time how could we not you know appreciate it thank you for real that's oh, awesome yeah. think of a better space too bad we can't get out the cali and play in august i know right oh but yeah, we're that'd, trying that'd to do so it again sick. we're trying to do it again sometime yeah. next year so we'll 100 percent reach out to you guys when it's time maybe we can set it up yeah. We'll probably we'll probably start it. working on that in like September or October. I would imagine. I, I, yeah, I mean, or March or April. You, you have to share your pajamas. Uh, I, for, <laughs> I, <laughs> first of, for, I in, in all in all serious though, like B, BG, are you in Snoop Dogg's garden right now? I am in Snoop Dogg's garden right now. <laughs> Pluck one of these leaves real quick. I'm jealous. <laughs> uh, I do have another. Speaking of all the fire that's in the video, though. Speaking of all the fire. In the office, the episode "The Fire." Oh, Who yeah. actually started the fire and how? I got it. I got it. White root. White root, and he started it in a trash can. <laughs> I love when they throw the cat in the ceiling. In <laughs> that is not correct. Oh, wait! It was it was Ryan with the cheesy pita. Ryan started the fight. That, that is did. correct. Was it, was it, was it, was Ryan it. left his pita in the toaster oven too long, oh, but yeah. Dwight finds out. Oh, that <laughs> is how the fire was started. Let's see what it lands on. Ryan, <laughs> Ryan was too busy. What's up, Smokey? Being, too busy being sexy and distracting the office, and he burnt his cheesy pita. My cheesy so, pita. So as they were talking about, we're having a a festival on August 13th in Southern California. Uh, It's going to be, I think, 18 artists total. We have two more battle bands to uh, to pick. Have you you ever had a cheesy pita before? I've not. Sounds. You don't know what that is, do you? Now we have to. Mm, I don't. It's probably some disgusting. It's 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 the cheat the cheat the cheesy the cheesy pita. (laughs) What? No, it, it is. It is totally the same. It's epic. now I gotta know what is pita, man. Is that's when that's 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 when that's when you lube it up. You lube it up with nacho cheese, okay? Okay. And you put it right in the two hole. It's the only time and you... double dipping is allowed. Yeah. I thought this had to do with something with their. Oh product. no, dude. <laughs> no, you knew right away. This is the most unprofessional interview you guys have ever had. So. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Welcome to our band practice. That's, this is what yeah. this is. We let's, play for like twenty minutes. The rest of us is shooting the shit for about three hours. Let's <laughs> let's jam uh, up <laughs> one more one more random band and, and see what we think. This is a uh, morbid psychosis. Oh, we can have a chat. All right. We start explaining what that word. Morbid psychosis. Do they really? It's not bad. I mean, it's 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 definitely not bad. I feel like he could be he could benefit a lot from a little bit more umph to his voice. He needs a little more confidence, and he needs to rock out with those singing parts, just a little bit of auto tune, just to pitch shift that. Because I feel like it'll pop really hard with that beat. It's a good call. That, that beat was like pretty a, tight. It's got a fire. Uh, that track. beat was sweet. Yeah, he's, it was good though. That was, that was definitely solid. Fellas, what's what's the top three best video games ever made? 
Oh shit! Oh god, Tony, Tony, You're asking the right person. <laughs> Tony, okay. what you got for me, Tony? Gonna jump on me. What kind okay. Of so, if we're going Nintendo, okay. Um, you say Zelda, I'm, Zelda. I'm gonna say Ninja Gaiden's number one. Uh, that's the original. Number two would be. Uh, I don't like Call of Duty, so I can't say that. But um, I'm gonna say what? Grand Theft Auto, San Andreas. For the PlayStation. Okay. The PlayStation 2. Um, and number three would have to be... Oh, man. He said uh, of all time, though. Of all time? Mm, Halo? Some pretty good Halo games 3. right there. Well I, thought I, out. I like, I like Mutant League football. <laughs> it's an old school one. Yes. I used to like Blitz. Blitz is pretty cool. I playing Ghost of Tsushima again. That game's pretty awesome. Dude, I'm an old school strategy nerd, so I like shit on computer like... Like you know, mist, command and conquer. I was about to say that. Like or like Oregon Trail, <laughs> Oregon Trail, right? Yeah. Dude, yeah. Oregon Trail. Hell yeah! yeah. Oregon <laughs> Trail, <laughs> shit. You, 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 yeah. Yeah. Oregon Trail. You've, you've got. You you you've died of you've died of, you've died of syphilis of the anus. <laughs> Damn it! Damn it! What? Oh, I couldn't, I couldn't raise enough corn. I got typhoid <laughs> Mary and my fucking big. I can never beat those games. I can never beat those games. Hey, speaking of Grand Theft Auto, there was a there was a big leak the other day. So so it's it's pretty much a rumored that leak, huh? Grand Theft Auto Six is a brother and a sister duo game where the cartel kills their parents, and one of them goes into like the police force, and one of them goes into the cartel, and you can be either one, and it's like two different stories, but it takes place like over multiple different states, not just one. Yeah, I read that. That's gonna be sweet. See, why? Why are you gonna make this all morbid, man? We were just having a good time. I know. I'm sorry. Family members killing each other. Sorry. Let's see. Is is Sean still joining too? I I sent him the link, man. Let's find out. Oh, I'll, break I'll out hit him up. Up. We'll stall. I'm watching. No I know. I know you had posts. What's up? Yeah, breathe up, Sean. Follow. That's him. I think he might be on. For those who think Halo is the, the you know, number one game of all time, I'm sorry. Halo is cool, but it's it's not it's not my fave. Oh, I, 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 I looked at the screen real quick and I th I saw I thought it said space balls. Space space. <laughs> From so, not able to stump anyone on any of those. He was trying to form the his other band in the office, Kevin in the Zits. <laughs> Kevin in the zits. <laughs> aye, aye. Um, fellas, it landed on pick the next song. Who's a band that you guys uh, really respect in the area that we need to know about? Just like a local band. In the area? Yeah, like local to you guys. I'd say uh, local Grizzly, 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 Grizzly Run. run. They're there, boys. Grizzly Run. Uh, Cold Feet oh, they yeah. have a video of. You can check that out. Grizzly Grizzly run. Run down. Okay, yeah. Grizzly Run's good dudes. Yeah. Oh, we've played it before. Okay, it doesn't sound familiar. Yeah, Let's check dope. it out. Let's jam it. Sounds pretty, uh, pretty damn good too. I'm gonna say yay, yay for that. A funny little backstory of the name Grizzly Run. Uh, there's like a theme park that's like <laughs> been to Six Flags and it's called Darien Lake here. And one of the amusement rides, like a water ride, was called Grizzly Run. So that's what the band name is from. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> Hell yeah. yeah. Dropping it's knowledge. knowledge. It's classic, though. Dropping oh, so the good. knowledge, for sure. Yeah. Hell Sean yeah. Told me, Sean told me he was jumping on, so I don't know if um, he sent you anything or whatever. But he said he was jumping on just like two minutes ago. Uh, I did not have anything. So... I guess we'll wait for a second. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, no, no, no sweat, man. No sweat at all. Oh, yeah, so with Grizzly Run, too. So, unfortunately, for that Attack Attack show, Andy's going to be, well, unfortunately for us, but not for him. He'll, he'll be on a cruise with his wife for anniversary style. Ten years? Uh, so, Sam is filling Congrats. in for us. Sam from, yeah, so Sam from Grizzly will be uh, playing with us at that show. 
Oh yeah, well, way to way to keep the 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 train moving as far as the, the yeah. I was the one. I was like, we're not we're not not playing this show. Like we're definitely doing it. Like I already knew the triple book, but I'm like, it's I, a family meal. <laughs> yeah, I can't skip out on the ten year anniversary. I'd probably get my balls uh, sipped off for that one. Oh, that one. I suppose that since Sean's hopping in, we'll we'll get uh we'll get him Run in it here. Back. We'll get him yeah, in yeah. here right now. we go and then i'm gonna spotlight him for a little bit if that's cool with you guys oh, oh dude. yeah absolutely Where is he at? he's got some goodies to share too yeah tell a homeboy to get his uh camera up oh. dude are we live right now <laughs> we <laughs> are live don't worry it happens to almost everybody it, it defaults with the the camera and the mic like just off uh so basically uh we're not gonna have camera um yeah i was like setting everything up and i or 15 minutes earlier than I expected. So uh, you just got my voice today. Sorry. Oh, that's totally cool. Uh, we asked them earlier, but how did how did the feature come about from your perspective, Sean, regarding working with Red Letter? Like has come about, um, like as far as like them reaching out to me. Yeah, like so what did what did you think when you heard the track? Like um, just in general. Oh, uh, generally, you know, um, I, I go through all the people that hit me up as far as. Um, is my mic fine good before I continue? Yeah, yeah, you yeah, sound great. Good. Okay, cool. Um, uh, I have had like past experiences with them, um, so that filtered into it as well. You know, I'm, I don't generally just do features for anybody or any band, um, and uh, I think this is actually the first music video I did as well. Yeah, it for is. a feature. Uh, yeah, um, so it was Hell a cool yeah. experience, and, and like, yeah, uh, when we went to Buffalo, uh, hung out with the dudes, they opened up for a show. Uh, quite a great experience. Some of the best dudes, um, they were so sweet. They even bought us like a handle of vodka, or uh, whiskey it was. I think it was like Jack Daniels or something. <laughs> shit. Yeah. Um, Excellent. Just, Excellent. I enjoy being around people like that. That's all, you know? Ah, I can totally people. dig it. Good vibes. Good vibes for sure. Let's uh, we just we just jammed the song a couple minutes ago, uh, "Burn It Down," which is fantastic. The video to like, uh, go along with it is even more fantastic. Uh, we're just gonna spin it here just again for just for a quick second. Fuck. God. Give me so good. Yeah. I wish I, I wish I had a camera. Yeah, I wish we had a camera too. <laughs> Dude, I was cheesing the whole time. Like, honestly, honestly, yes. like for real, it's just crazy going from like. <laughs> I was never in the studio with you guys, so like I heard everything as like raw, unedited, and like I was down. I was already down, but to hear the project done and to see the video and everything you guys like have been able to create with that, like oh man, like I was, I may have got some goosebumps there for a minute, for real. <laughs> yeah, it's it came out amazing. Just, thank you, brother. Yeah, thanks for and and you know and again you know much love and thanks for being a part of it, man. No, I mean, I mean, why would I not? <laughs> yeah, it's it's superb. It's Legend. superb for real. Legends. Hey, do, uh, BG, do you you feel like uh, ripping uh, his newest video, uh, Brain Sick? Fuck yeah! Right, oh, yeah, guys! Oh, here. that's so sweet. Oh Let's man! Up in it. This, you know this I'm song with it. Rips. This is badass, dude. For real. That guy's yeah. mad. That guy's yeah. really pissed Jeez. off. Woo! Goodness. <laughs> yeah, dude. If you're in like if you're in like a good mood, just don't listen to that. It's just pissed. <laughs> Put me in a better mood, I'm saying. What if I was in a really good mood? I'm in a better like mood. Yeah, I get in a better mood with shit like that. Yeah, did yeah. <laughs> Sean, what do you what do you got going on the rest of the day, dude? Um so uh I've got I've got kids. That's that's <laughs> it's awesome. Uh yeah dad time um they're beautiful kids and they're okay. they were giving me a moment to enjoy this uh so we'll we'll take it as it goes you know for sure how, how are th how are things with the new lady brother did you say what how are how are how are things with the new lady brother <laughs> did you say lady yeah we see those posts oh shit don't do this to me right now yeah. oh man <laughs> You say what? What? <laughs> Thank God I'm not on camera. <laughs> ah. You bless um, him. So dude, um, question through your SS, 
Yeah. Dude, um, yeah, I'm speechless, man. I've never met a person like her. Uh, she brings out the absolute best of me. That's all I'll, I'll really say about that. I'm not going to make your, your interview. Let's give him a round of applause on that one. Oh, oh yeah. God. What the hell, Play guys? Play it safe. Play it safe. It's cool. <laughs> <laughs> hell, yeah. yeah. That was beautiful. I appreciate uh, that, guys. So what? When? When? When did? How did uh, Sumerian come about? As far as uh, you guys jumping on there with with Ash. Oh, you want a story, really? I do. I would um, like okay. a, a good story, please. Um, I'm getting asked to open some um, pretzel almond nuggets real quick, and I Eat did em. it. So we're good now. Yeah, kids entertained now. Um, we're back. Um, so. <laughs> <laughs> we were we were a younger band we were only a band for a couple months before he got signed um but there was another musician that was from maryland and he played for a band called burning season well they, they were a baltimore based kind of um his name's chris jocelyn he was ash Appleton's best friend um i got home one day i think it was from warp tour something i was at something um and I have this message like, hey, dude, uh, we I, I, I think I can get you signed, but I need you to do like to go record some songs. And I was like, dude, we just finished a demo. Like, how am I going to convince my band to go back into the studio um, and re record again? And I actually like I lied to them and told them <clears throat> it was free, but I like had paid for everything. <laughs> Um, so we recorded that and then months later, you know, Sumerian, uh, well, we played for Chris live in Ohio in the middle of a snowstorm, uh, with, uh, for the fallen dreams and for today, like before they, before for today, like really popped off. Um, and we finished the set and, uh, Chris came out and said, here's your paperwork. If you want to sign it, you're signed to Sumerian. Um, it was kind of surreal because we were kind of talking to CI Records. Or Wait, no, this is like you walked right off the stage and they just hand you the paperwork like that. They were just like, I mean, they probably give us a couple drinks after, but yeah, pretty much. Um, awesome. Yeah, uh, it was surreal. But we had been talking to Solid State Records at the time, and they wanted us to sign with CI Records. I don't know if I should say this. I don't give a fuck anymore though. Um, they wanted us to sign to CI Records and change our name, and I had put so much emotion into the name for that. And I was like, no. And then this happened. So it was, it was, yeah, like what dreams are made of, I guess. Are you allowed to say that the the band name that they wanted you to become? Uh, there was none because I wasn't going to fucking do that. <laughs> Good call. Good call. Fair enough. Good call. It, was, it was like this or nothing kind of thing because, I don't know, it kind of caught on. There's a couple I, the bands now. So it's like, you know, it worked out. Shame on them because, you know. They're lost. They, yeah. I'm glad we got to be a part of Sumerianos. Dave thinks about it. Why is there a horse? You gotta, you gotta ask, ask what Dave's thoughts are on the subject. What, what are the thoughts? <laughs> ah, he's mad. Aye, aye, aye. Hell yeah. But yeah, I peeped y'all's stream earlier. It was great, man. I think what you guys are doing is beautiful. Um, Thank you. Yeah, it starts with the roots. The roots I appreciate everywhere. that a lot. Thank you so much for real. It's awesome. Uh, yes. Sean, we, we'll let you go back to your kids. Enjoy the rest of your evening, dude. But we, we appreciate you just come out and spending a couple of minutes with us, dude. You didn't have to do this, um, but we, we really are grateful for it. And uh, the video with Red Letter is incredible. I, I think it's kind of hilarious that you hadn't seen it before we'd seen it, but we got that experience you <laughs> seeing it for the first time, which is pretty cool. But um, you're awesome, brother. I think it's fucked up. I think it's fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> but it's all good because I hey, listen. I tr I listen, trust when that. I text when I text you 9 p.m. EST, that means Eastern Standard Time. <laughs> <laughs> that Yo, was the first time we aired it, brother. No one's seen it besides us, so you're good. To be fair, you hit me up at. 8:40. My oh, oh shit! No. Oh shit! Oh shit! I was listen. You, you, listen. I fucked who, up. Fucked up. Who, who, listen. I got. I got a webcam. I'll pull up the text right now, hater. It it worked <laughs> out perfectly though. It worked out perfect because we got to hang with Dude. you guys for a while and then get to the the no, video no, after no. jamming your stuff. John, and then he came in so right much. afterwards, so it worked out perfectly. Hey man, I'm not having one of my best days, and and thank you guys for for being accommodating and understanding. I'm glad oh, we. Can... Uh, <laughs> I was. Anytime, man. Yeah, you're awesome. I was about to join an hour from now, to be honest with you, because I had it back. <laughs> I fucked it's, up. 
It's all good, man. Thank you for thank <laughs> thank you for coming on, brother. All right, you guys have a wonderful night. Thanks for having me. Cheers, Sean. We appreciate Cheers. it. Cheers. Here, buddy. Yeah. See you. Hell yeah. Uh, what do you guys got going on the rest of the day? Yeah. Whoa. Nice. Oh, like, well, yeah, I mean, we're all here. We're all here. Limp biscuit, uh, limp biscuit style, circle jerk. Uh, yeah. <laughs> now, are you guys gonna jam or work on? It's almost kind of clock, so probably nothing. Much. Look at we're doing. What are we doing? The guns off the the beach that way? I don't. I don't know what's happening behind me. I don't. You know. <laughs> we gotta. We, go. we have to somewhat try to finish the show at some point. But you guys were awesome. This is one of the most fun <laughs> interviews I've had in a really long time. And, I, and I'm. I'm being honest. Not only was the song absolutely just bonkers crazy the video to pair with it is just incredible also um if i were you guys i would debut it on some form of major youtube channel as far as like the where it uh, airs well, first well we tried so we we tried so we sent we sent it we sent it a, like that's why it's been taking a while we sent it to dreambound for Oh my God! It's been like two months. We messaged them several times, and they never got back to us. So you know, I and if you have any other suggestions, feel free to hit me up. But we're working with uh, a few guys that are helping with us with uh, some PR and everything else. But um, if you have any other suggestions, yeah, you know, well, I'll text you, you after you this. You can text me anytime. Yeah, I'll, te I'll text you so. after this. There's a couple of that that we would suggest for sure that would uh, would help. Sick. But um, yeah, man, yeah. appreciate you. Cool. You guys are fantastic, man. For real. Uh, much success. Thanks. We'll talk about the 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 hopefully getting you over here to California in like March or April. Um, oh, yeah, let's go. Oh, yeah, let's go. Yeah. yeah. Plan on it, <laughs> fellas. We love you. Red letter, everybody. Give me a hell yeah. Thank you, guys.